Hello! We are super back down here south on the Murray Isle as we are gonna pick up this treasure. Um, yeah. So basically now, after we explore the, s the square to the south, we're basically gonna have already the whole half of the world explored. And not to mention that on the other side of the world, there are already several spots that have been uh, discovered. You know, so technically there is absolutely less work to do on the other side. Especially since that I picked that the west uh, the west first, so I was pretty sure that uh, that I was gonna take longer. So I just wanted that the last episodes would be more pleasant to watch, since it would be less things to do and also more things to pick up. Because there are very m many interesting things on the east eastern side. So, uh, yeah, and we're going to be also finding those weird uh, islands that look like a bunch of, uh, you know, like really small places that you just need to go through just very fast. So here we have another platform. Um, basically, what I do with the platforms is that, okay. Okay, here's the deal. I, you know, I did this Fable with the Lost Chapter walkthrough. The thing about Fable is that I skipped a lot. I'm not saying that what I did was bad. Man, they're shooting at me bad. <laughs> I'm just saying that a lot of people complain about that. You know, and then on this walkthrough, I decide not to skip too much. And then people are complaining that I don't that I don't skip a lot, you know. And in the end of the day, I'm just not gonna worry about what people say anymore, because with all honesty, it's like you really can't do anything right, no matter how you do it. And in the end, I also find out that I kind of agree that skipping too much is bad, because then when people are uh, playing this game they're gonna be like I wonder where that is because uh, he skips so much that I don't know where it is I'm pretty sure that with Fable at all chapters people are not gonna get lost because the game is very linear it's very hard to not get lost but you know a game like this it's a game that is so vast that if I skip too much I mean you guys are just not gonna know exactly where I am and stuff like that so I'm just trying to give you a feel of the places that I'm at so that you don't have any question questions later on I know that there will always be question questions because there are going to be people out there who start watching the LP from episode 40 and forward and then they'll be asking uh, where did I get my bow or something like that and I'll be like oh then I can't help those people but you know I'm just saying that I mean, this is some, uh, a hobby of mine, and people are taking it so seriously. I mean, I take it seriously because uh, gaming, to me, is like, you know, it's, it's, it's serious. You know, it's it's kind of weird to say it like that, but it is. You know, it's the best thing I, I'm, I, I'm good at in life. It's not that I'm not good at other stuff. I'm good at many things, but, you know, gaming is like the top number one thing that I'm good at. And, you know, it's something that I recognize, so, I'm just, uh, pointing out that to the people out there to just, oh, I, this is, uh, yeah, Headstone Island, <laughs> cool, uh, yeah, so that's pretty much what I'm trying to get at. Uh, seriously, like, hell. <laughs> 
You don't want to skip a lot, you want to skip a lot, you, you, you won't want this, you don't want... No, it's not what you want, guys. I mean, if you've subscribed to me, it's because you enjoy what I do. So, chill. <laughs> Man, it turned tonight, but the lag wasn't so bad. I'm so glad. And it's, you know, and I enjoy the night uh, graphics and stuff, but, well, you know. <coughs> die, die. Oh, I got that one. Oh, I didn't get this one. But that was really cool. <laughs> I mean, he was standing there on watch. And all of a sudden, a bomb exploded on him. He was like, ah, cruel world. It's one of those ugly chests. I'm not sure if there's going to be anything at all. Well, let's go there anyways. I'm gonna be ah, skipping my travel to the south to the empty square to complete the first half of the world and uh, yeah so uh, I'll be right back guys <laughs> the spot of where the octo that we killed for the fairy so uh, basically we don't need it anymore since it's already dead <laughs> but just pointing out that uh, just in case you didn't get this octo this is where you get it a little to the south of the eye reef <coughs> but you gotta have a good eye I suggest you do it on daylight at night is really bad. Ow. We should have turned it into daylight so I could have more time. So we'll probably turn it into daylight life on its own. Oof. Since uh, this one doesn't have many cannons, I'm taking them out. Woo! Oh, that reminds me that I also uh, skipped a lot in the beginning of this LP, but it was for the purpose of leaving all the action for the end. So, uh, you know, there are a lot of little uh, treasures here. We can get like 50 rupees. I think you gotta take these ones too. we go. Cool. So let's go up there. And since we're almost out of time, might as well just, yeah. <laughs> and these are reef are very similar. Like this tex texture and all that stuff. I don't know, but if I made a video game, I would make sure that absolutely no place in the world looks the same. And I know that making video games is very hard and a lot of work, but uh, I don't know. I just would opt to make this game that has a vast world where no spot will look the same at all. So, you know. That goes for... Uh, other games out there that have very similar rooms and stuff. So let's uh, grab this. Obviously, uh, T chart. Treasure chart. These are for you. 
and explanations always. Man, I hate explanations. Um. Open up. And yes, yeah, one of those places around the world. So next uh, part, we'll go in east. And uh, yeah. I don't see any right now for this eye reef. Mm. Mm, no. No. Okay. So I'll see you guys on the next part. And there's lag. Thank you for watching. <laughs> bye bye, guys. Whoa.